Hey, what is up guys? It's Chris and you already know we stand Before I start this video, I kind of want to just start off with a little update on my channel So I've been posting you know every week I'm still gonna post every week of course and I know I'm trying to put out random TikTok compilations because they keep getting a lot of views so hopefully more people will find my channel but I am still working on more music stuff you know I have two parodies out right now one original song I bought a microphone a few weeks ago it's just taking forever to ship because of everything going on but I have like two really good songs that I can't wait to release I just need to perfect them and you know record them with a better microphone and then obviously make music videos for them so yeah I just wanted to update you guys on that for today's video I thought I would just tell you guys a funny story that happened to me when I was in middle school I'm I think it was sixth or seventh grade I'm not completely sure which year so Here's the story. I got invited to this party. You know, all the cool kids were there. Everyone was super cool. We were all dancing. This could tell what year it was. It was the time that was like a popular song at the time of this. So it was this girl's party. We were all dancing in her garage. And so she comes out with a $15 iTunes card, you know, in middle school, $15, that's a lot. I'm like, yo, I need this iTunes card. She says, the winner of a dance-off is gonna get it. And before this, I don't know who it was, but one of the older people there, whenever I'm sexy and I know it would come on, he would tell me to air hump. So basically it was like, you know how it goes, like, and it's like, and it's like the beat. Anytime that happens, I was just air humping. Eventually, I made it into the final two of the dance-off, literally just by air humping, pretty much. I know, kind of cringe. Just picture this, party rock anthem comes on, I'm just there, like... Like, I, I don't know, in like seventh grade or something, like, I know, it's hilarious. So, anyways, I made it to the final two, and it's me versus this other guy, and we're facing off, we're facing off at the song, we keep like switching off every like 20 seconds or something. I kept getting the best parts of the song, and I would just keep air humping, and everyone would go crazy. So like, obviously I just kept doing that, and it was looking like I was gonna win, and then, the most embarrassing moment of my middle school career happened because my opponent while i was air humping decided to sneak around and pantsed me yeah he pantsed me thank god he didn't get my underwear with it it was just my pants <sighs> thank god i would have never lived that down or i don't know maybe i would have had a completely different reaction but if you remember one of my other videos recently, I said I was a crybaby when I was little. This was still at the time that I was a crybaby. Yeah, 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 no, I was still kind of a crybaby in middle school. So basically, I just started crying and I cried for like literally the entire rest of the party. Looking back, I'm like, bro, it's just like, he didn't even get your underwear. Like, why did you care? Like, so yeah, he pants me and then I ended up winning because everyone was like, wow, why would you pants him? And then it made me cry. So like, they felt bad. So I got the iTunes card. Hey, free iTunes, $15, woo. Okay. And then all my friends kept trying to like cheer me up because they felt bad for me, I guess. So one of them was like, hey, at least you were the first guy to have your pants off in a room full of girls. And thinking of that too, that my friend said I was the first one with his pants off in a room full of girls. There were guys there too. I didn't even care. I just like kept crying. I don't know why. I guess like once I started crying, it was just like a cycle and I just kept crying. And then eventually my mom picked me up and yeah. So that's basically the story on that. Pretty embarrassing. But if he got my underwear, I can only imagine what would have happened. Yikes. Yeah, I mean, I guess I'll just keep this video short and sweet. So 
thank you guys for watching make sure you stay tuned i'm thinking i'm gonna release a video soon um about how to grow on social media so if you're interested in that i'll probably be uploading that semi soon so make sure you leave a like subscribe if you're not interested still subscribe and leave a like anyways i'm trying to put out like two videos per week we'll see sometimes i do like three or just one but anyways you guys already know stan chris stay woke peace